Now, the England defender John Terry has denied that he snapped and used a racist obscenity after he was taunted by fellow player Anton Ferdinand. He's accused of racially abusing Ferdinand during a Premier League match in October last year. Terry claimed he was sarcastically repeating the words Ferdinand thought he had used. Our sports reporter, Kamian Zerum, was in court. And just to warn you, his report does contain some of the language in question. John Terry, the victim, the prosecution sarcastically suggested today. The victim of a black opponent who'd played the race card. The defence implied when the former England captain was called to give evidence in his race abuse trial this afternoon. Mr Terry denies racially abusing Anton Ferdinand during a game last autumn, although admits using offensive words. He insists he was only repeating the words f off, f off, f black, back to Mr Ferdinand, who'd wrongly accused him of saying them in the first place. But with this footage immediately circulating on the internet, the FA soon began investigating. The court was played a recording of an FA interview later that week. I've been called a lot of things in, in my football career and outside of football as well, but being a racist is not one I'm prepared to take at all. You know, and that's why you know, I come out and made my statement instantly. Um, and I'm, I'm not having anyone, and let alone Anton, think that at all about me because that's not my character at all. Mr Terry explained from the witness box how he'd been arguing with Mr Ferdinand after a disputed foul. And he described how he'd first been goaded about a well-publicised affair and then accused of using racist language. The prosecution say he lost control. John Terry said that when Anton Ferdinand accused him of racist abuse, he couldn't control his emotions. The prosecutor, Duncan Penny, said, you couldn't, could you? Adding, you're not a racist but you used racist language and you snapped. John Terry said no. And referring to Anton Ferdinand, teasing him for shagging his teammates' misses, said, I'd heard that for two years or so, maybe a hundred, a million times. If I was going to snap, I'd have snapped long ago. It is the prosecution's case, though, that Mr Ferdinand's wind-up did make Mr Terry snap, something he continues to deny. He was asked... Have you thought about apologising to Anton for what you said? Mr Terry replied... Why would I apologise to Anton when he's the one who accused me? What I said was in response to what Anton said to me. John Terry's cross-examination will continue tomorrow morning, after which further witnesses may be called.